first poem I'm going to read is a sestina, classical form, uh, six stanzas with a combination of words that are repeated in a very arcane, it's like an inversion, exploding inversion from each stanza, and then there's a three-line envoy at the end that uses the two of the two of the repeating words each line. It's very complicated to write. Um, I suspect that they were originally written to kind of show off like double and triple entendres on words. I'm not that good with them, but we'll see what uh, we'll see what we get. This is uh, entitled on Cadman admonishing a high school English student, Cadman being the first spoken word artist. The legend goes that Cadman was a Scottish goat herder who just spontaneously began speaking poetry. Never wrote any of it down and just spoke poetry until he died. Uh, depending on how good he was, probably depends on you know, how, how much longer he lived. And oh, should I lament ever I spoke a word of verse or metered rhyme, if I could journey back in time, would that I kept silent, might there never be such poetry. And if there were no poetry, should any now lament, I wonder, what if Will, the muse struck silent, would he have found the metered word? And what verse would he devise given time without the precedence of rhyme? Or cantoed pound, what if his rhyme? What if he were allowed a choice between poetry or his mind? Could we have caught in time and spared his madness? Surely Olson did lament proud Ezra ever wrote a single word. Or would Chuck have known a hero if Pound stayed silent? Whither Whitman gaily silent, he'd become a precious dandy bereft of rhyme. His flesh would replace his holy word, his body electric. But without poetry to conduct his song, would he lament his unfulfilled promise, his wasted time? And Emily, oh, Emily, how much time could you have known? Too soon silent and cold, I fear you'd grow. And who'd lament the loss, the subtle play of rhyme, the broken meter, such sublime poetry? I'd miss your armed man, pierced by sword of word. And old Ben Johnson, what if he'd not penned a word? We would be poorer for this, I suspect, in time. Life would taste less sweet without poetry. The discourse of men might grow coarse and silent, with no pretty words wrapped in fragile rhyme to heal the wounds all lovers do lament. Poetry, O oh shape of greatness hung upon crafted word, do not lament my sins, for it could be such in time. <coughs> You're glad I stayed unsighted. You may yet have need of rhyme.